and I need to start oh. my webcam. And will you cut uh, the games in pieces? So the first, uh, the second game, or yeah, I will do it separately. Make... Okay. So will you uh, when we start the game, let let us know so we can also unpause it. Yeah. Uh, just no, to... you can watch on Chessy the Emperor uh, on the main um, display. Yeah, you can do that if you want. Oh, okay. Well, oh, yeah, Discord. But, uh... I can see when he starts. Okay, that's true. But I'll, I mean, I want to spectate the game as well, so I can uh, find what Jesse the Emperor misses. As uh -huh, I have yes. noticed the unfortunate habit of Jesse the Emperor to look away when just when the fight starts. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> hmm. All right. So um, let's have a look. Uh, yeah, so I'm going to start the game now. Uh, I'm going to click on load replay now. So there we go. And I'm in the game. Okay. Exciting stuff. Yeah. Oh, you, you oh. have the wrong game, I think. Yeah, right away <laughs> we can see that you have the wrong game. Ah, but this is this is uh, game one in WhatsApp. No, no, no. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> <What? laughs> How is that possible? Yeah, I, I downloaded this one. Okay, we, we can just watch this one. It's fine. <laughs> okay. It's Berbers versus Indians. So uh, or, I don't or know. Is this the one that has seen already? It's the game one here. The game one. No. This is the one I downloaded. I haven't seen Kim. Okay, then, then let's just cast this one and we will watch Jess's stream. Excellent. Okay. So this yeah. is probably game two then. <laughs> okay. But we can pretend it's game one. Yeah, exactly. So, mm. um, so yeah, show us where the players are uh, placing yeah. their town finger. Mm. So we have Akka in the corner of the map here. And um, their Vazal is in grey, which is a really annoying colour. Yeah, it seems right to be their Vazal's favourite colour. And uh, maybe that is... Camouflaged. Of... Ah, here it is. Oh yeah. Hey, you're pretty strange. And, ah! I mean, their Haraka just walks past it. Oh! What? It shot down a sheep, but not the villager. It's interesting. Akka going for the early lame, stealing two sheep, but mm. losing one to the TC fire. Yeah. Mm. A very aggressive start, and now there was all wants to retaliate, but he's too yeah. late because the TC is up. Uh, he needs to go back. Or he will be shot. Oh. Yeah. Oof. Very close. Lost a lot of HP there. So he has to dock for uh, the Akka. Nice with shorefish. Um. Ah, and here also shorefish for. There was home. So that's good. Yeah, so. We're scouting by the Rizal. Obviously, they know where, where they are. Which is good. Oh, wow, look at that. Her Akar has so much of the map already. What? <laughs> no, no, it's not her Akar. <laughs> oh, oh, this, this is, is Gaia. Gaia. This is Gaia. <laughs> oh, I didn't know. This is interesting. It's like the animals, I think. Anyway, he scouted much, much more anyway. <laughs> Interesting yeah, but... that the fish don't have line of sight for Gaia. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> yep, yeah, that's what's going on. Let's look at the will counts. 7 for the Vassal, 7 for Akkar. It goes nicely. And in hand, and going for woods. Where are the ships? Yeah, well, I don't have enough wood yet. First, now... first ship of uh, the Akkar. And oh, yeah, the Vassal as well. Uh, Akka is going for a loom to not get housed, I think. Mm. Or maybe yeah. he has has not. Uh, yeah, he has not. Someone is housed. To too. It Harker is housed, yeah. Mm. Or was housed. Oh. It was all his house. Ah, yeah. Yeah, Akka was doing loom. Uh, mm. Well done by him. Because he had a fishing ship in the queue, and if he would have pulled a villager, um, he would get, or he would be housed. So. Yeah. 
this was what I mean. Mm. Ah, yeah, that's, mm, that's a good right. point. And that is something, uh, Jesse, that you could learn as well. Uh, I noticed that uh, you are often housed as well. So in that case, just uh, mm -hmm. uncue the villager and, and click loom. Mm. Okay. So, so you don't lose the TC time. I think uh, there was a uh, walling too close to himself. Ah, He's walling himself yeah. in. Classic nomad mistake, walling himself in. Imagine a tower in the back of that wood line. Yeah. Yeah, but for that reason, I think um, Devasal has two good woodlands and maybe a counter tower and attempt of the Ogre would be gone. Yeah, would they have nine villagers on wood? That's uh, ridiculous. Well, you don't need more to keep up fishing ship production, ah, I think. Here we go. Finally, some, some food taking by our Ogre, so he'll be able to go up to the feudal age sooner. I think okay. the relic is blocking the film mm. placement almost. Yeah. Indeed, <laughs> yes. But this is what I love so much about Nomad. Players are very close, and I I think the action can start any second now. I'm surprised actually that neither player is going for some more laming. Yeah. yeah and and Herake has a pretty well scouting, and he found a lot of sheep on the map, mm -hmm. and uh, this can also boost his. Uptime. Exactly. Yeah. Let's okay. see what's the um, the boar here. Boar here. Obviously, they share this boar, so. <laughs> and Vasal is building his <laughs> barracks as usual. Yeah. I mean, not not taking that boar when you know the enemy is so close. That's just sloppy. Mm -hmm. And in terms of the fish, our archer has a much better position to fish the, uh, the open waters. Whereas there was all this, uh, well, this is kind of a shitty location to put a dock. Yeah, but um, if there was all redocks on the top, yeah. you can also destroy the fish and has a has uh, the corner for him. A lot of fish there. Yeah, he could, but he needs to do it. And usually, I prefer to walk to the corner and get the dock up there. Yeah. So I don't need to redock immediately. Exactly. <laughs> Indeed, but usually your root uh, would be in the left or in the bottom corner. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So militia coming out. That's interesting. So, guys, but what do still, you think about, what do you think about militias on Nomad? Mixed. I think it's good if you can upgrade them to men at arms as soon as you hit feudal. Yeah, but. I think if uh, your opponent um, tower rushes you, they can be good, but they are also pretty slow and, and with the exposed areas on Nomad on later game, I would prefer some scouts in fuel or yeah. uh, later nights because of the speed, the moving speed, they move too, too slow. Mm. Yeah, so I would say uh, I would never go for militias almost because no. You want to get up to Fuel Age and build fire galleys and attack the fishing ships because that's yeah. the most vulnerable part that's of the true, actually. Eco. Yeah. And but the... I'm not even sure if they know where each other's fishing is, that's also I think, something. Uh, and the militia and Dark Age delay your Fuel Age time and then the enemy can tower exactly. you and, and send fire galleys. Yeah, the I militias, think... look at that, they, where would they even attack? Everything is in yeah. range of Herakas Town Center. That is true. Yeah. Yeah. And um, I think in general, uh, her Ocker is so much in a, in a better position because he has much more food, so he can go up to the feudal age very soon. Uh, oh, actually, Vassal is not too bad as well. Now. He's got the food, so he should click up now. Uh, and yeah, Ocker already did. Really yeah. Oh yeah. Indeed. Indeed, Ocker slacking on the production. Yeah. But the... he does have the better fishing grounds, so... Militia are really doing nothing. It's ridiculous. Why well, does he can't... even make them? Yeah, they can't attack. Where, where would they attack? Yeah. Well, that's true. Like, oh, maybe here. <laughs> but where? now Herakka is moving out because I guess yeah. he wants to go for gold. Because there is no gold in his base. Ah. Yeah. And then... He has a lot of idols and... Uh, There's not much gold here. The closest gold is over here. Of course, unless he wants to lame this one, but... I mean, yeah, he's gonna walk really far if he... And Akka already mining... 
Oh, interesting. Gonna be a little. Uh, I like the mining camp of her acker. It's yeah. uh, the right distance. Maybe could, I could actually be. No, it it should be one tile further to the northeast. Mm. It's closer. So it touch the corner. Yeah, but then the results I would say is too close because it blocks the surfaces. I would put it a bit to the northeast as well. Yeah, indeed, it's a it's a sloppy mining camp mm. there. <laughs> All right, so we've got a bit of action here. Militia, they both have militia. Ah, uh, yeah, but yeah, they're yeah. gonna lose that because the villagers are just gonna just kill the militia. So yeah, that's why they're not very useful. Well, they will be oh, a good what's place this? to attack, but you need to send more than two. Ah, tower. Ah, oh, but with yeah, no but... support. Mm -hmm. Indeed, and I also don't like the position. Um, Haoka knows about the gold. He knows that um, he has none of, no, and uh, by not putting the tower a little bit next to the goat. Mm, malicious. Uh, oh, man at arms. Yeah. No. His men at arms were killed before they could do anything. And now we've got a okay, massive I build fight. Uh, Aka should pull back the weak villager. Yeah. But he's not seeing it, and now Vazal is just bringing so many more villagers. This will mm. be a victory for their Vazal. Yeah. But Herakka is retreating now, isn't he? No. Yeah, indeed. He is. Two, ah, but getting out with two weak villagers. Herakka has more villagers now. Aye. So that fight was not too, too bad in the end for Herakka. Hmm. But now, ah, it's very risky trying to get up this tower here. Uh, I think maybe delete the tower to not lose uh, the resources. Yeah. And, yeah, and build it behind the wood line in the. I would say in the north of the yeah. space. Indeed, yeah. This would hurt because... Devazal a lot more Yes, the tower on the berries. Yes, and Devazal, unless he deletes his house, he has to walk a long distance to get there. Mm. Teraka now giving up on his tower rush. There's a lot of fishing ships. Oh, what's happened to Teraka's fishing ships? Where, where did they go? Oh, on the top. Uh, the shorefish line, right? Yeah. No, you mean there was all fishing. Yeah. Okay, okay. Oh, here they are. Oh, they're just fishing some shorefish. Oh, okay, on oh, very a lot of idols. Yeah, this is Ooh. not good. Yeah, they are. Oh, look at that. Clearly, oh, ah, they're oh, all they getting them off the the stone. Is there anything to mine around? Oh, look the camp. Tower Nothing. From yeah. Green tower. That's the tower I love. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> and even dropping a forward market, that was all. And blacksmith. That's uh, interesting. He's rolling his villagers in. Yeah, I'm not sure if that's. Well, yeah, you should just wall in the tower and, and walk yeah. away and build exactly. more towers. But, yeah. but that's yeah. a perfect tower. Well done, that was all. This tower was really worth it, yes. Yeah, I mean, that's not looking bad what Devazal is doing mm. here. It, clearly, he has a lot of experience on Nomad, so he knows where to place these towers. Ooh, a and, bit of build fight. Now... Oh, the men at arms are coming. Yeah, it's, it's just so powerful to have some men at arms if he wants to do a tower rush, just because he can really you know, support yeah. your advances. I would say a nomad. If you go for militias, build them when oh, you wow, have more. clicked up to the fuel age. Wow, that's more, yeah. And the the villages are getting slaughtered. Ooh, and that is very just... bad for her acker. Look at her acker is behind in village count. It's just going down and down and down. Ah, that's a great man at arms tower rush for yeah. Devazal. Yeah. Oh, but, and, oh, okay, we, I didn't notice that Aka advanced to Castle Age. Yes, that is pretty cool. Uh, okay, that's not necessary, I would say. An offensive well, tower. Uh, no, I think it's good because otherwise the result can just creep in more and more. But, mm. well, but maybe the location is not ideal. Yeah, exactly, it's right next to the town center. But he's losing villagers and... Um, Oh, he's lost villagers and he's behind six villagers now. Okay, okay let's, let's go. Yeah, but, he wanted to uh, secure the wood line. Yeah. 
but there's but already he's... a tower from there. Yeah. <laughs> exactly. It, it it covers the entire uh, wood line, so he can't. He can't do that. So yeah, he needs to get rid of those towers now if he wants to keep chopping wood, or he needs to go somewhere else. He, need, he needs to uh, produce some knights to clean up the towers. Oh wow, look so many men at arms and spearmen yes. everywhere. Der Vasal is already anticipating the knights and the yeah. Akka is cursing. Maybe he's yeah, saying... Akka GG! Shit. GG, damn or something. Yeah. What? Already? Why? Why? Was that... Did you think that was a... Should that be have been a GG? I don't know. Um... No, I wouldn't have GG, GG, GG no. here as long as my fish are working. Exactly, look at this fish coming much better than her Akkers, which is idle. Or and, very and inefficient. Akka was castle age, so he, the only yes. problem was he, he needed to have some some gold somewhere, so he should... He didn't... Snuck what? Oh no, this guy. Yeah, he didn't have so much gold. gold, that was the problem. Um, did, did he and see where was, there was gold? You, you can just sneak oh, out to the other side of the map because... With the men at arms, they're so slow that Devasal will not find you, most likely. I look at it, but there was all on every resource here. Like this gold, that gold. Here. Yeah. So yeah, there wasn't yeah. much opportunity for the Herr to get on gold. Except if you'd gone, yeah, a bit more scouting, maybe, but... Yeah. Indeed, it was well played by Devasal. I would say the, the one weak point in Devasal's play here was that he didn't go for uh, fire galleys. Well, both players didn't. Yeah. If, well, if you if you can hit the enemy's fish economy on early castle edge, for example, it's so hard to get up the mess of knights and with upgrades and um, yeah to run up your town centers with villager production. So there you can hurt your enemy really hard. Yeah. 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 So timeline not much to see. Yeah. Yeah, well, uh, exciting. Uh, a very, uh, a very quick game indeed. Swift victory from there was all not wasting any time. Yeah. In dispatching, dispatching Heraka. And the Heraka uh, seemed uh, overrun. Uh, just um, not prepared for such a capable opponent. Yeah, yeah and maybe he, he was prepared. For the early aggression of Devasal, because I think, um, yeah, it's it's untypical to go for like six or seven men at arms like Devasal does. Yeah, but that's almost a trademark play of Devasal. Yeah, indeed. Mm. Yeah, in most of the games, he he tends to go for malicious. <laughs> Normally, you should know that, yes. Yeah. yeah. Indeed. Ah, so I know. That's a lack of preparation on Herr Akka's side here as well. He was supposed to play. What happens? Uh, I just put put us in the the creator study, so I can uh, cast you. Nope. Oh. What's going on? What? Well, we're in the casting studio. Got kicked out here. Okay. All right. So I'm uh, saying goodbye now. Are you gonna cast the next game as well? Yes. Oh, yeah, we should. Yes. Are you? Uh, are you? Are you done for today? Yeah. It's already eleven here. I want to go to bed. Ah. Uh, okay. Fair enough. Uh, that was a, a quick one. So uh, yeah. Let's uh, do, do the rest of the games uh, later. But I mean, you feel free to, to cast the next one. Yeah, I'm, okay. I'm going to play this one, yes. Okay, well, I might uh, cast the rest then. So yeah, I'll see you, uh, I'll see you next time. Okay. okay, have a good night. Yes. Good night. Good night. All right, so it's just me, just your emperor, and uh, let's go and uh, look at the next game. So let me just set that up. I need to download it. All right. Um, and then... Um...
get it in the right folder. Which is a bit of a pain. There we go. And then I need to. Okay, I think I've got it. So let's load the replay and um, look at the second game of. The Acker versus their Vassal. So this is uh, another nomad, but it's a desert nomad map. Okay. So um, a bit of will fighting here already. I mean, why did not their Vassal not go for it? Yeah, there we go. He's going for it and with two villagers now. You know. Her Akka has to run away and, and uh, Derazal is going to make his town center. Okay, and her Akka also... Oh, what? That is super close. They're super close to each other. Is there, Does Derazal know? He says, haha. No, he doesn't. Okay, does her Akka know? I mean, he, he knew that there were two villagers there, so why did he go so close? Maybe maybe he knows where uh, there was all this, but yeah, tricky. Okay, bad dog placement from the Rizal. Last game he had quite a good dog, but um, yeah. Uh, oh no, that was our Akker had the good dog. So again, the Rizal... Um, Clearly needs to learn how, where to put his harbor, always in the corner of the map. You know, okay, these corners are not particularly good, but they're still better than on the side. Alright, so our Akra is housed. And, um, yeah. Let's see how that goes. So I'm just going to put on my, on my Twitch. Uh, chat room on my phone so I can actually monitor what's going on there. Um, oh, that's the, the bad thing about not having two screens. Okay. There we go. Okay. So I can now see any chat that's coming in. And uh, I see that Haaka has a better placement, you know, closer to Little Fish, but still not perfect. Okay, but it is what it is. Okay, so our Akra has a nice location here with the, the berries. Next to the berries. And their Valsal. Yeah, well, there's wood, there's gold nearby, but also her Akra has gold and stone nearby. So, no stone for um, their Valsal. So, overall, I think the location of the town center is better for her Akra. And he also has a better book placement. And uh, her Akra uh, lost the last game though. And did a GG when uh, the result did his uh, Man at Arms and Tower Rush. And so far, not, not much happening against, uh, you know, except Akra getting housed again. There was all nearly getting housed here, but he produced a house before that happens. That's good. And um, yeah, looking a little bit boring for for now. I'm wondering if they already know. Yeah. So there was all knows the her ochre is there, and. Ah, Herr Akker doesn't know, but now he's going to find out. Um, oh, okay, a bit of a will fight coming up here. Uh, there's an idol here, maybe can, he can help, but he doesn't have much HP, so... Okay, well, now, surely now Herr Akker will know that the Townsend is very close. But who knows, maybe not. Herr Akker getting housed again! Very sloppy, very sloppy. 
But her archer score is still higher. And he's too ahead in villager count. And I suspect that's because of fishing ships. Yeah, one fishing ship actually. And probably one villager then. Yeah, okay. So there was all going for a defensive wall, like last time. Fine, that, that that's not too not too close to the to the, his own town center, so that's fine. What's this? A barracks? No! What? A barracks next to the wall? Why would you do that? He doesn't know there's a wall. <gasps> what? Oh, look at this just over here. Uh, that would be a massive pain. Uh, you'll find out soon enough. And again, house. Come on, Nervazal. Oh, yeah, Ucker, sorry. Yeah, Ucker, you're housed again. Okay, now he finds out. Shit. There's a wall there. Can't do much here. Yeah. Okay, the result. Come on, get some laming on. Okay, uh, forward house. That's okay then. Yeah. Okay, still happily fishing away here until this tile is done, and then it's gonna be very inefficient. And then he's, you know, he's got to build another dock already. Okay, so let's see. Little ostriches. Oh. oh, what's this? Shooting down two ostriches? Oh, it's laming. Okay, fair enough. Could have shot this third one as well, but fair enough. Okay, now what's going on here? Ah, oh, he's gonna sh get shot down. Yeah. Oh, uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. What? Well, where's the rest? Okay, get out. Yeah. Don't keep them idle. Right, so in terms of score, they're very similar. Uh, oh, their bazaar has three villagers more. What? A douche? Are they, is he gonna do a douche? What was that? What? No, not a douche! What the hell is this? Did he just... Did he press the wrong button by accident? I mean, what's the purpose of this? Is, does he want to target the, the wood line or something? Why? Yeah? But he, he still can't shoot down the, the town center, so it's not a douche. That is, was a really weird move, but he's killing villagers! If <gasps> all not, not able to fit... To, ah, he's got, he can shoot it down another villager. Just, just put two villagers in there so he can keep shooting. No. What? Look at that one. Uh, you can shoot these, this one as well, maybe, uh, just... Ah, yeah, there we go. So, uh, where are we now in terms of build, build count? Still, there was all this up, or uh, still more, more, you know, five more than than uh, Herr Akka. And it's reflected in this core, I mean... A lot of, it must be a lot of idle time, I mean, why is Herr Akka so far behind in the account? Maybe the douche was not such a good... It wasn't even a douche, it's, it's like, well, that's ridiculous. Okay, well, that was a big mistake, a uh, ridiculous mistake. I've never seen something like that. Okay, yeah, now, that, okay, militia, just gonna get wasted on trying to get this, uh, this palisade wall. It's not gonna work. Alright, so, you can just walk around. Why doesn't he just send them? Oh, okay, well, he's gathering some. Yeah, take this one as well. No. He's just gonna go with the two. Okay. There was a little idol here. Um, but yeah. He said in village account. Uh, but he's not researching uh, feudal age yet. And um, her acker is. Um, it's a bit late. There are already 15 minutes, 16 minutes almost. Um, so yeah. A bit late. Uh, and very late for her acker to not. Yet have clicked up. I mean, he's not been collecting much uh, food. He's wasted a lot of resource on rebuilding his town center. 
Now he's doing a tower rush, but there's no one here anyway because the town center can just shoot down any villagers. So that was also a wasteful tower there. Um, yeah. Okay. There was all protecting himself from the the one militia that's trying to break in. Okay, fair enough. Okay. These militia are gonna get shot down by the TC. Yeah. Oh no. Okay. Two lost two militia. That was kind of useless, but yeah. Okay. Well, Acker at least is in the fuel age, and hopefully we'll. You know, once that happens, he can upgrade his Mish to Men Arms, and then he can make the tower. But he needs to wait because no, actually, uh, there was a can't see. And yes, I know what's going on here, but not much consequential. Oh, this was a mistake. Uh, Akar putting it in the line of sight of the Vazal. I mean, there was like now just. Deny this tower really easily, and he is gonna do it. He's first gonna kill the militia because they're not upgraded to metal arms yet. Uh, the Akra was too early, and now, yeah, now he can deny this tower. Classic mistake. I mean, what did he think? What did Akra think? He can build a, a tower with one, one villager and one militia. That's. Uh, that's obviously very ridiculous. Why is this not getting denied? Destroy this. I mean, deny his resources. Yarvazal destroyed the tower. No, he's going for the defensive tower instead, which is also fine. Okay, well, again, this is uh, inconsequential because but if Yarvazal was looking out, he could deny this, this tower really easily without having to build a tower, actually. He could just kill the militia and the villager with, you know, three villagers and not have to make a tower here. Okay, so that, well, that was not very useful. But he was walling in her Akra, that's really nice. There was all might win this one again. I, I like how there was all playing things. Although he's only just gone into few days, but that's fine. What's this? Um. Men at arms coming out. Okay, well, obviously, already lost all of his militia, so. You know, before he got upgraded, what is this? A market? Okay. Fine. And uh, they're just all preparing to go to Carl Sage, so yeah, there we have it again. They're all with his men at arms. And. Yeah, Ucker is probably going for scouts. Yeah, this is this is bad. I mean, her Akker was in feudal age much earlier. Um, he lost so many militia. You know, just running out of the town center, getting killed by villagers, and now Derazal has more men at arms than him. And in terms of villager counts, her Akker is way way behind now. And yeah, I don't think this is gonna turn out well for her Akra. The result has some idols. But yeah, it's just killing villagers. Killing the men at arms. I don't think this is stoppable anymore. Look at the score of Ervazal as well. Look at the villager count. This is. I mean, at this point, at this point, would you call the GG? I don't know, but I definitely don't think that her arc is going to recover from this. I think this is going to be another... Ah, uh, yeah, no, it's just going to kill all those villagers. No, okay, he's... he's yeah, look at that, man, it, it is. I mean, at this point, her arc has half the villagers of their vassal. Their vassal happily... You know, obviously needs to cut more on food if he wants to go to the castle age. He's got already much more, much more uh, gold here. Just get these off, off the gold and make some farms. Oh, he's going for archers as well. Yeah, I mean, this is... At this point, it might as well be a GG for... Um, for Arker. 
Okay, these men arms are gonna get shot down. If he's not careful. Very low HP now, they, they can't go under the, the fire anymore. Yeah, so we might as well call the GG now. Might as well. Yeah, got some archers. Maybe they can deny the, uh, the goals here for their, um, their Akkar. Just making sure. Oh, okay, so Herr Akkar is going for the fire ship finally. Which is something we would like to see earlier. But yeah, dock placements should, should have built another dock by now because this is not this is not efficient. Anyway, he's going for fire ships, so that's nice. Uh, that could give him a bit, you know, it's definitely the, the right move to make. And who knows, maybe he can get back in the game and, and equal out the, the village number. But uh, yeah, he's killing the fishing ships and you can see it in the stats. And no response from, from their vassal so far, except from building another dock, which I don't know what the purpose of that is. And he's just letting his fishing ships get killed. He could just run away with the ships, as he's doing with these, I think. Oh no, it's just that he's got another dock here, which is... Both docks, not very good placement, you know, very inefficient docks here. What's the purpose of this dock? I mean, you should have built the dock here, or here, or here, anywhere, but... This is a ridiculous dock placement. Hey, yeah, his fishing ships are just gonna get, are just gonna get killed here. Yeah, just happily waiting for the fire ship to get to kill them. And uh, actually, not much action happening from their vassal right now. Okay, he destroyed this building, but yeah, in terms of villager numbers, her Akker can now recover. He's been allowed to, you know. Uh, equalize. That's okay. One. Why is there one fishing ship left? Where Where did the fire ship go? That's weird. Anyway, okay. Some nice micro from the Vizal with his archers, but still losing one. I think it's the right move to go for archers against uh, men at arms, but still losing two archers against two men at arms. So, but now yeah, now you can safely from a distance shoot down the villagers. So that's really good. Um, oh, but he's running into the fire. So there we go. That one is gone. And uh, yeah, with that, the results now to castle age. And let's look at the wheel count again. Okay, still, Arker's still far ahead. He says, damn, too weak. It's too weak to do anything against their Vassal now. Okay, their Vassal's fishing economy is completely idle now. Or or gone, so that's good. But her Arker's economy isn't doing much better. Okay, it's still active, but it's really inefficient. Yeah, okay, so a bit of a... Lull in action, I'm not sure what their Vazal is planning on doing now. Don't see any production. I see a fire ship, I, I see a knight coming out. Also a spearman from her Akkar, yeah, so he knows what's going on. Okay, what are they doing? No. So yeah, the spearman already there to kind of protect against the, the knights, so that's good, but at this point the result can just keep producing the knights and um, yeah, you can get Akra off the gold now, kill his villagers, kill two villagers, I think uh, now it's running into spearmen, so that's not great for uh, the result. Okay, so he has to retreat now, but he's done a bit of damage already. And yeah, I don't see how Air Akker is going to get back from this, unless... Ah! A GG from Air Akker already now, yeah, okay. 
I mean, he could have gone, you know, produce some more spearmen, just walk around. And, you know, if, if Jefferson hadn't really pushed too much as he, you know, he didn't seem very aggressive. Maybe he could have come back, you know, destroy these fishing, fishing villagers. You know, rebuild the dock. Get that eco, eco really efficient. Like here, yeah, excellent. Another dock now, finally. Um, yeah. And, okay, I wouldn't have called the GG yet. But, you know, fair enough here. Arker was definitely behind in all the stats. And, and and you could see that quite clearly. He was the first to go into feudal, but he didn't he didn't make use of it. And he, he, he wasted his militia. And, uh, yeah, he wasted uh, resources with the deletion of his uh, town center. And then the, uh, the weird tower placement. So, yeah, fair enough. Um, a win for uh, Jervazal again. So let's uh, see what the third game will bring. Uh, well, obviously, Jervazal has already won this uh, series of three. Um, so I'm going to now load the... Uh, the next game. Let's see how quick I can do it this time. Okay, I've loaded the game. Uh, now I need to go back in and... Right, let's go and um, look at the third and final game already uh, a win for uh, Der Vazal in this series of three, which is expected, of course. Um, but yeah, let's see if her Acker can at least gain one win in this series. So this is a nice little map with cows. Seems very. Nice little tame map. Nice little tame nomad map. And yeah. Relatively peaceful. Nice little music going on. Let's see if the game is going to be that peaceful as well. So yeah, we have the Razal over here. Close to the wood line, some stone. Arker again very close and the result knows and he's doing a little bit of a will fight here. That's a significant um That's a significant advantage in Nomad always to know where your opponent is. So yeah again uh looking good for the result in this early part of the game. Very nice. What is this? Ah the result is laming the gold, that's excellent. Ah, uh, I love that move. Come on and build these ones first because you, you're going to be in the, the line of fire. But okay. Fair enough. And let's see if the dock placement is any better. Again, very poor dock placement by their Vazal. And... Let's see. Let's see, does Akar notice? He should know. Look, what is he doing? Go and uh, disrupt the lamer. Ah, now. Only now. Okay. He's going. Ah, no. What? Go and stop that villager from laming your gold. Not reacting. Okay. Okay, so now yeah, Akka also knows where the TC is. At least he should have known, but for some reason the dance the disappeared. Which is really weird. Okay, so he shot that one down, but you know, he's already lamed now. Yeah. Okay, so now the, the cow is gone, so her Akka should know that the town center is there. Um, let's see. Uh, also, poor dog placement by her Akka. Yeah. Yeah. 
Ah, what's this? Her Akra laming the the stone or attempting to, but obviously very close to the TC. So the Vassal did react and, and shoots him, tried to shoot him down, and he uh, he shot down the the walls. A forward house here from Her Akra to kind of keep the line of sight. Okay, fair enough. A good, you know, early grab of the the boar by the Vassal. You know, to make sure that his opponent doesn't get get the boar. So that's that's nice. There's still one. Oh yeah. So now, now here Akar only has one boar left, and there is all. Okay, he's got another boar there. But yeah, so he, he he potentially has two boars to to feed on. I just like it when they go for a bit of uh, early food because that's good to go go for an early feudal. Okay, so they're all countering the the forward house. Okay, fair enough. But yeah, I like that. You know, for us all, this this early laming that's that's really great. But her Akra is ahead in village account by by one. Oh, by two now. Uh, what's going on? I mean, how, Defra Sal, why are you two behind already? Is a lot of idle time. Let's have a look. What? His town center is idle. It's still idle. It's been idle for uh, at least a minute, if not longer. Keep being idle, what? Only now does he few villagers, and he is already three villagers behind. Okay. But in terms of resources, yeah, there was uh, Arker. Arker is doing better. So yeah, let's see if our Arker can take this game, even though he's already heavily lamed and getting walled in now by, by the houses from there was all. Is this a backward goal there for our Arker, but not much more actually except from that. So, you know, there was also actually in a better position here. Um, he's got this gold, um, which is relatively safe, it seems. But yeah, there's not that much gold actually on this map. So, okay, who's who's housed here? Her archer is housed. Okay, he only has two houses at this point. Yeah, and he's getting walled in. He's getting walled in. Yeah. And um, yes, you know he still had three villagers. But what is this? He he's, he went to build a house with six villagers. That's ridiculous. Even four villagers is ridiculous. Just go with two. Because now you've got all this idle time here. Okay. Well, let's see what happens next. The scores are pretty close. You know, uh, there was all running in now, only one villager um, behind her Akra. And in terms of fishing, you know, still fishing fine, but they'll be out of fish soon and then he, they need to put a, another dog on. So is that, is that what this villager is going to do? I don't know. So it's just has been idle the whole game, I think. Two villagers actually idle, probably meant to be building docks or maybe scouting, I don't know. Um, okay. Yeah, some idols for her archer. Retask the wedding. Um, so yeah, her archer is uh, clicking up to feudal again. The first one to do that. And he will be first for a while because the result is not even close to having enough food for um, we're going up to the feudal again, quite late. Uh, yeah, it's surprising because you know the Vassal had uh, a big villager lead for a long time. It obviously had some idols, so who knows? Maybe that's why. In terms of village count, you know they're equal again now, so almost equal. Ooh. 
A lot of stone here by Hacker. A strange outward stone post. I suppose it would have been... It's not the closest stone, but... First stone he found, probably. Um, okay, so... He probably... I'm not sure what he's gonna gonna do. Maybe a tower rush with militia again. Yeah, so he's building the barracks now. And uh, yeah, so the barracks should have gone up earlier. Could have already made the militia and now, you know, uh, done the uh, man arms upgrades. He's a little bit behind in building this barracks, but fair enough. Still no militia being queued, so I don't know what he wants to do with that barracks. Apparently nothing. And yeah, it gives uh, time to re the result to go to feudal. And he's constructing the barracks a bit quicker, still a bit late. But he can now maybe queue some villagers uh, as a militia. And then uh, upgrade them to my arms. Yes, that's what's he exactly what he's doing. And now uh, finally... Air Akra also making militia, and uh, you know we saw this tower going up, um, a little bit inconsequential because it's not really, you know, it can just be shot down by the town center, not really blocking any resources. It would have been better, you know, near the wood line or near the gold. Again, this tower way too far. I mean, what can it do? It doesn't hurt any villagers, and you know anywhere. So, yeah. And this tower is gonna go down now. Okay. Right, so. The result now has already four militia. Quite a lot of militia. These players really love their militia. Oh, anyway, four militia already queued up. And now he should upgrade his militia to men at arms before he sends them out. Um, come on and do that now. Okay, okay maybe he can sweep up these. Two militia, but you can also shoot them down with the town center. Yeah, which is exactly what he's doing. Yeah, so complete waste from Herr Acker. Yeah, again, went up to the feudal age first, but um, he had to use his advantage. It was very interesting. Anyway, in terms of fishing, they were all doing okay now. He has Docks, indeed, that was the plan of these villagers to, to create some food income. And yeah, now they've resolved with his upgraded men at arms. Yeah. Um, his house, though, but yeah, he can now go and come on, kill these villagers, kill these villagers with your men at arms, that's what they're for. But no, he lets the defensive tower being built. Okay, now he's gonna kill the villagers, come on, he can kill so many villagers. But he, yeah, it was too late. Now it is the tower and the TC to shoot down those men at arms. No idols here. But yeah, again, I like the position of the result more because his fishing is going well. Yeah, not much going in terms of the archer's fishing economy. And yeah, here, Akra didn't, didn't really use his early feudal age to do anything. Okay, so these men are... Come on, there's no murder hole, so just go and destroy this tower. Yeah. There we go. Destroy this tower soon. And this is interesting. Yeah, the result... I mean, can easily yeah, destroy this one as well. So another very successful tower game by Akra. You know, partly because he's, he lacked the... The men at arms, he didn't upgrade the militia. And yeah, another defensive tower going up here, which is useless because as we could you know could see these men at arms can just walk up to the tower and just destroy it. Um which is not something he's doing, which is a bit of a shame because he could have destroyed this tower and then kill all, all of these villagers, all of these villagers. But he's going for I don't know what he's doing. Look at how many are already in those barracks. And you can just come out and at this point, yeah, you can just flood their Arkham and kill all his villagers, basically. I mean, that's ridiculous. Yeah. 
This man at arms game is ridiculous. These players are just going for men at arms and tower rush all the time. Mind you, quite poor tower rushes, but a lot of men at arms. Um, so yeah, there, there comes the army. Yeah, it's just a ridiculous men at arms army. I mean, what, what can our Arker do against that? That's going to be an OGG. What's this? I don't think a stable is the right answer for this. Maybe, you know, siege weapons, maybe archers. See, archers and um, skirmishers, maybe. Cheaper units. Skirmishers and. and. Um, and, and a. Um, siege. An onager. Yeah. And they go and kill these villagers and kill the, you know, kill the stables that are researching bloodlines. But that's not what he's doing. He's just going away, just giving our Akar a bit more time. You know, I've got I've put so much resources in making a huge man arms army, but I'm just gonna walk around the map and you know just let our Akar recover a bit. That's what he's doing. Okay. So yeah, there was all going for some scouts now as well. I hear Arker still going for scouts too for some inexplicable reason because there's no use against men at arms. Um, and yeah, there was all just roaming around with his men at arms for no reason. That's a bit strange. I mean, he could just have finished it now. Just come in with these men at arms, kill all of these villagers. You know. Okay, so he also went for some spearmen to counter the. The scouts. <sighs> yeah, come on. The results just go in and can kill so many villagers here. I know. Don't be too scared for the, that fire. I mean, if you kill so many villagers, it's gonna be worth it. Or at least. You know, destroy some buildings, you know. Yeah, definitely not looking good for her. Okay, I mean, I expect the GG to come very soon. You know, finish accounts. Oh yeah, finish accounts is actually surprisingly close. But yeah, in terms of uh, military units, he's not going for the right units. And yeah, so... Oh no, why would you go with your scout to, to the spearmen? That's ridiculous, but obviously my arm is doing well. But still not good enough. Still not good enough. He needs to, he needs to spare his uh, men armors. Not give them away like that. Um, and he needs to build a siege workshop and an archery range. But that's not what he's doing. Yeah, the result in not giving away his spearmen. So that's nice. But again. Cavalry is not the answer to uh, to these men at arms. So, oh, finally a blacksmith. Not a uh, blacksmith. Okay, I I want to see an archery range. I want to see a siege workshop. And yes, still there was all happily running around with his army, just doing nothing. It's an absurd, absurd game. I mean, he's just gonna let her Akka recover from this, and yeah. Arker is, uh, is feeling okay now, like he's safe. Got, got some military here, he's just trying to get his economy going. You know, it, obviously ignoring his fishing ship still, so that's not great. But he's going for, uh, for a fire ship, so maybe he can damage the Rizal's economy. Okay, so here we go, the Rizal can now destroy the army of her Arker. And uh, destroy the little house, so maybe... Oh no, look at that! Uh, our Akka actually seems to be overwhelming the army of Dervasal now. That is very interesting. And look at the scores, they're really equalizing now. And if this fire ship goes... Let's have a look if our Akka can see this. No. But if this fire ship would go and explore and see where the fishing ships are and, you know... Then our Akka could definitely make a comeback here. Okay. That's very interesting. 
I did not expect that to happen, but yeah. Very interesting. No, I suppose obviously those towers helped with the metal arms because metal arms are not very good against um, ranged attack. So maybe that's why he had to keep out of, of Herakar's base. But hey, I think at this point Herakar Her will win this engagement if. There was all goes for it, but yeah, they're just going back and forth, back and forth. But there was all is in Castle Age now, and yeah, Herr Acker not even close. He doesn't have any gold. He's still not on gold actually. And yeah, that that is gonna be the be the end of Herr Acker, I think. Now, now that there was all is in Castle Age, he can make the upgrades. He can make the uh, the knights. And uh, and then that's that's gonna be it. Oh, that's nice. Yeah. Oh no. Yeah, nice indeed. Uh, but uh, Herr Acker finally going for archers, losing his army here. I know there's two archers here already, but yeah, they're getting shot down by the tower. I definitely think the archers is a good move, but he can upgrade those already. Okay, you now he needs to be. He needs to go to. Uh, he needs to go to Castle Age first. And he's researching Castle Age now, that's interesting. So let's see if... Um, if Herr Acker can withstand and hold on uh, while um, Herr Acker Vazal is booming into the Castle Age. I doubt it. Yeah, okay, here's some protection for, for the fishing ships already. So the opportunity of Herr Acker to destroy the fishing ship fishing fleet is gone. There was all now going for a castle drop, which is very nice. Gonna deny this this gold, which yeah, I like the placement of this this castle. You know, shoot down this these towers and and get rid of this this gold. Get, get this gold. Yeah, that's nice. Yeah, finally these these archers are in place to to weather. To, to attack these these uh, these ground units, but yeah, this uh, this castle is going to be a deadly, and I wouldn't be surprised if there was going to be GG. Who's 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 now? Um, who's Carl's now coming out? So yeah, once they flood and raid the economy of Herak, I think that's going to be the GG. Where are the fishing ships? Oh, okay. Her, her Acker finally made a different dock, but not in the right location again. He went up to Castle Age, so let's see what's going on. Um, does her Acker have enough for a counter castle? Yes, he does. Oh, he's gonna get his archers are being, getting picked off. Now. No, what's this? A very defensive castle, but doesn't make sense, and nothing in the town center to. I mean, he, these knights have free reign here. Okay, trying to wall. It's very just with losing a lot of villagers. Very sloppy. I mean, just gar garrison some villagers into the town. No, he's just gonna let all of the villagers get killed. It's panicking or something, and no, it's ridiculous. Okay, now this 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 castle find here, but look at this. Village guns, you know, 29 against 53 for the Vassal. No, that's not looking good at all. This very defensive castle placement. It's not going to be very useful. Okay, he's going for petards, sneaky petards. Not quite sure what he's going to do with those. Maybe make a little uh, tiny Quirin move here. And maybe he can petard down this town center. Yeah, no way he's gonna get to this one because of the tower here and better arms. Yeah, that's interesting. I even wonder whether this petard was a. Uh, these petards were intentional. I mean, what is this petard doing? 
walking around. It's chilling. I think this villager is trapped as well. Yeah, very sloppy, very sloppy. I mean, I, the results should have finished this game long ago, of course. But yeah, it's gonna, it's not gonna take that much longer before it's... No, let's get these Huskarls out already. What are they doing? How many Huskarls has he already? Oh, okay, five. That's not that many. Okay, so you... It was all just happily booming, you know, just, uh, okay, you know, I'm okay, I'm just doing fine, so just build up the economy, make some more military, no, actually he's not making any military, just doing some upgrades, okay, Ocker just like, yeah, just making some petards, just gonna chill there, not quite sure what they're there for. Oh, he can maybe petter down this castle. Why not? Yeah, so there was all really creeping in on their uh, my Arkar doing this. Yeah, now the petters get mobilized. And I'm really curious to see where they're going. No! What? They're just gonna get shot down by the castle. <gasps> oh no, in the house girls. Uh, the petters got denied the other castle. Ah. Disaster! Complete waste! Ah! These petards are doing nothing. Nothing for Herr Acker. Yeah, now the Huskarls are out. And where are the Huskarls actually? And it's a GG from Acker with that second castle drop. And yeah. Um, I, I, yeah, well. Three games won by the result. Um, yeah, it's just strange how Ocker keeps going to Feudal Age first, but then not using that. Look at that. Almost no military. Almost no military. Nothing happening here. And yeah, as, as soon as the result hits Feudal, he goes and reproduces a lot of, a lot of men at arms. So, yeah. Um, more archers would have been would have been good counter and um, oh yeah, siege workshop is is castle castle age isn't it? Yeah, I think it is castle age. Not quite sure anymore. Well, anyway, three games won by um, the others also. Yeah, clearly, Arkan needs to do some more training in the. Uh, the Age of Empires to challenge that uh, Food Police has set us, and uh, I would be happy to play again against uh, Herr Acker and see um, how it goes. Um, so that's the plan. But first, I need to have another coach game with Peter Host, which I missed today, unfortunately. A little, uh, a little emergency. I, I was uh, I was an hour late. And obviously, it's later in Germany, so unfortunately, I missed that game. But this weekend, I'll I'll play the game, and uh, yeah, I wonder if Food Please has another challenge for me to uh, to perform this week. Uh, maybe I'll just have to practice some more one v one ranked games and and uh, get my skills up for the next Jesse the Emperor versus Herr Acker game. So yeah, that's it. That's it. That's what we want to see. So that's already the end of today's stream. And um, I look forward to seeing you again on Jesse the Emperor Twitch. And of course, watch all our YouTube uh, videos on Food Please Age of Empires on YouTube. Okay, see you next time.